Through his playing career, till date, Mohindra Manath has borne the brunt and more than once paid the price for being a straight talker. Along with the issue of Dhoni's place in the test team and his merit as a test captain, another matter that came to light from his chat with Times Now was the reason why he was so unceremoniously dropped from the selection committee. The hero of the 1983 World Cup win. Mohindra Manath was a big name included in the selection panel in 2011. Then in 2012, he was clipped to replace Chris Srikant as chairman of selectors. But instead, after just one term, he got the axe. I mean, th that is an area into which I do not want to go. See, all I can, all I said is that I elaborated the system that we followed, that is all. But this becomes personal, this I should not know. Amar Nath was drafted into the selection panel when Indian cricket was going through its biggest crisis in recent years. A mauling in England, followed by a disaster in Australia. He was there through the debacles in England and Australia and logic would have it that Mohinder Amarnath continue and be made chairman of selectors so that he could set matters right. But that was not to be. The BCCI top bosses reckoned Mohinder Amarnath should get the boot. The reasons why he wasn't persisted with now out in the open. His opposition to Dhoni's position as captain led to his removal. Yesterday you said that nobody has the guts to uh, remove uh, Mahinder Singh Dhoni. Why did you say that? No, very true if you see his track record for the last one year as a captain. Uh, I'm talking about only test matches, not one day. He's done very well in one day cricket. Uh, he hasn't done much to be very honest. He's not led from the front. Straight talking and honest. But it seems Amar Nath's approach was too blunt for the BCCI to handle. Sports Bureau Times now.